Yo, yo, it's Scuba Steve Stables. I'm back with another video. Today we are jumping on my favorite site, Hawku. Let's go. We're gonna be looking at Genesis horses. Are they worth buying in today's market? Um, and we're gonna be look, we're gonna be checking the f the floor price. You know, of course, we only want to look at two things. We want to check the lowest possible Genesis, you know, horse and in its price. Um, no matter if it's run or bred or what, and then we want to look at unraced, unbred. So let's start at the bottom. Genesis and Buterin. And we'll go to the lowest. Okay, so a Gen Butte that is not any good. Now we are playing is going to cost you 0 0.07 Ethereum. So close to uh, about $100. And if we look at the family, um, it hasn't even bred in, in 2.0 or 3.0. So maybe you could uh, pick up a horse there that is good at breeding. I don't know. Probably not. Look at it. <laughs> it starts down there. Um, so yeah, do I recommend going into buying one of these horses? No, I don't. Uh, I don't like buying the floor on you know the worst possible horse. I think some Genesis are just really bad and you should stay away. All right, let's have a look at pay uh, unraced. Unraced and we'll look at unbred too. Um, can you not do that? Breeding filters. What? You can't put in if if they you don't want. You know what? Colts are normally cheaper, so let's just look at the colts. Maybe if you know how to do the unbred thing, you can let me know in the comments below. Uh, so it's going to cost you 0 0.34 Ethereum to get an unraced, unbred. Uh, Colt, and we'll just have a look at the filly to see if it's the same. It's probably going to be a bit more. 0.5 for so half an Ethereum. So wow, we're really seeing the um, the market of Genesis unraced horses come back, which is awesome to see. Uh, do I recommend buying one of these horses? No, I don't really know. Be just it's too much of a risk. You know, you buy you buy a Genesis horse, it sucks, and you you bought it for 0.54 Ethereum. Now you're going to sell it for 0.07 Ethereum, which was the which was the um, you know the floor for a raced and bred uh, Butte Gen. Yeah, it's too risky, um, especially just for a Butte. Like, if you're going to get a Genesis horse, just to have a Genesis. In my opinion, I want the knack. So. Uh, let's have a look at the next one, Finny. The floor is 0.18 for a badly raced, badly bred horse. That's the cheapest you'll find. Now, if we go into filters and we put races to zero, we look at uh, the Colts first. It's going to cost you 0.79 to get a Colt uh, Finny, Genesis Colt. Do I recommend this price? You know, I'm on the I'm on the fence about that price. Yeah, I think you know you could go you could go for that one. That's a that's a decent horse, decent enough price to get a Z7 Finny. Yeah, I don't mind that one. Um, if we jump on over to Philly, 1.5 Ethereum. That's too much money. Okay, that's too much money. Although it is a Z6. You know, I'd like to see that come down, maybe 1.2, 1.1, something like that. If we look at the sales, there hasn't even been any sales, so maybe even 1.5. Uh, 
you know, these are the these are the last ones, guys. If you want, if you want this, you got to jump at it now. Um, all right, let's keep going up and working our way to a knack. All right, next one. So the floor is 0.57 for you know one that's a bit of a donkey. Um, Bread, raced. Do I recommend going this for a Z4 Genesis? I think at this point you have to you have to dive into their breeding family. Breed 2.0, breed 2.0, breed 2.0. So now it's your turn to weigh up. All right, this horse has not bred in 3.0. Maybe there's a little bit of talent there. Um, that's uh, that's something you got to weigh up. If you bought this horse, um, yeah, I don't think it's a terrible, uh, terrible uh, investment. Racing 2.0 profit is uh, zilch. He is a lifetime profit of negative. If we go to filters, race sixth. Hasn't even been raced in, in the new, um, the new update. So this one, look, if you got a spare 700 sitting around, Maybe not so bad. Um, you know, it's a filly too, which is crazy. Look at that. The next filly, oh, female, is at 0.7. That's not bad. Almost want to buy it myself. <laughs> uh, now let's look at unraced. And we'll check the Colts. So that's going to cost you two Ethereum. Do I recommend that? No, I don't. Uh, Philly, three Ethereum, I don't recommend that either, you know, unless it was a Z3 and that's four Ethereum. So risky, so risky. Um, you just don't know with the prices of Genesis if they're going to come down or not. Uh, let's go back. All right, the one we all want to see, the Gen Nac. Filters, Genesis, Nakamoto. Wow, you can get a, a Z2 Nakamoto Genesis Colt three hours ago for 1.89. That is not going to stay, surely. 1.89, what is it? A massive donkey or something? Wow. Who ran this horse? It ran 1800 and flamed and then never ran 1800 again. This horse is not staying around. Look at this. What is this? Just buy the horse. It's so cheap. All right. So that's, that's good. Is that worth it? Yes, it is. It's un, it's unbred for heaven's sake. Look at this thing. Come on. Oh, if I had money, I would definitely buy that. All right. Look at the next one, 2.39 Ethereum, and it's and it's tested. You know, it's done. Urgh. Someone give me money. All right, let's have a look at Unraced. This is where we're going to see the big bucks. Whoa, 15 Ethereum, Chance Air. You know, this could be a beast. This could be an absolute beast. Who's bidding? Six Ethereum. Not going to get it for that, mate. Um, filters. Let's have a look at the fillies. Prepare your eyes. Wow. Nine Ethereum. That's not bad. 18 Ethereum for a Z1, though. Yeah. Is, it, is, this, is this horse here, Climbing Thunder, worth 20,000? I don't know. Like, you, you look at Artois, Ready, Set, Boom... Horses like that, and they've you know they've made that they've made eight, eighteen Ethereum, well over eighteen Ethereum. So once we include uh, breeding, but you're also you could get this horse and you're sitting on a donkey, twenty thousand. Look, I wouldn't put twenty thousand of my own money in there, but if I was to earn enough money in Z to get up to that number, I would buy it. All right, guys, um, thanks for coming with me and checking out the prices on Horku, um, seeing what, you know, the floor is doing, things like that. And, 
yeah, thanks for the support on the channel. I really appreciate it. Please keep it coming. And yeah, I hope you're all enjoying, you know, the, the festivities of this time of the year. And I'll see you next time. So, Scuba Steve Stables, I'm over and out.